Do Pablo's English? No. Do you believe in God? Let's pray this works out. Christ the Redeemer. Welcome to Max Takes on the World. And today, I'm going to take a stranger to meet Christ. Christ the Redeemer, that is, here in Rio de Janeiro, one of the fabulous seven wonders of the world. But first, I have to find a stranger to take with me. So let's hit the streets. Finding someone to go with me to see Christ is already going to be a challenge. But I think the biggest challenge is going to be the language barrier because not that many people here speak English. So let's see what happens. This is definitely pushing me out of my comfort zone. I, I don't know who to ask. I want to ask someone that I think looks like they speak English, but how could you even tell like that person looks like they speak English? Hola. Um, you speak English? See? Si? What's your name? Alan. Alan Max. Looking for somebody to go to Christ the Redeemer with me. Do you want to go? No? Hola. Um, Pablo's English? No. I'm approaching the middle of Copacabana Beach and I'm hoping there's a lot more people. Hola. Um, you speak English? I know what you're thinking. Max, you've only asked girls so far. You should try asking some guys. I'm on it. Hola, hola. Uh, any of you guys speak English? English? No. no. I need to come up with a new strategy. Hmm, I'm trying to think. Hola. Um, to Pablo's English? No. I'm going to pull out my translator app. I can't spend all day trying to find someone, then I have no time to go to Christ. I have my message written out in the translator app. Let's try it again in Portuguese. Do you speak English? Yeah. Oh, thank God. You're lost. No, no, um, my name's Max, oh. and I'm looking for someone to meet Christ with today. You know Christ the Redeemer? Yeah. Yeah. Would you, so, be, would you be interested in going? Oh, no, I have to go back to work. Oh, okay. <laughs> thank you. All this walking up and down has definitely made me thirsty. I need to get a drink, recharge, come up with a plan, and then figure it out. While I'm sitting down in this restaurant here, I see a group of three behind me here. I think I might sit down, see if I can sit with them, earn their trust, and then ask if they want to meet Christ. Cheers! Not yet. I want actually. I'm, I want to visit Cristo today. Have you guys went? No. Have you guys been to Cristo? Yeah. yeah. Would you ever go again or something like that? No, not because we visit Cristo every year. Every year. Oh, yeah. But you should go yeah. this year. Other time. Yeah. The other. Other time. Yeah. Let's see. This is the tattoo I got. Oh, you see it? Yeah, Christo. Do you do here? Yeah, I got it here at Sugarloaf. Good to meet you guys. I'm gonna head out. Follow me on Instagram. Bye. 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 Have a great time. Thank you. I will. It was a great plan, and although it ultimately did not work because. They all had plans today, which is pretty normal. I did meet some nice people. Now I'm back on the streets to find someone. I am tired of walking around. Ah, uh, man. I need to find somebody. But more people are uh, speaking English than I thought, so that's a good thing. I just need to find somebody. Do you speak English? No. Uh, hola. Um, two Hablos in the last. Do you speak English? A little bit. Um, I'm looking for someone to go to uh, Cristo with me. Cristo, Cristo. and Cart. See, Cristo? No, no. Would you, you want to go to Cristo with me? 
Do you want to go to Cristo with me? Yo quiero ir por Cristo. Sí. Sí. Ya. What's your name? Bruno. Bruno. Your name? Max. Max. See. Uh, Maxwell. Maxwell. Yeah. You make these. That is beautiful. Look at these birds. Uh, how, how long does that take to make? Quanto um, time? Time? Uh, Para fazer? Si. Sí. Para fazer? Cinco minutos. Cinco? Five minutes? Five minutes. It's five minutes to make that. Wow. We are headed to see Christ. Uh, do you believe in God? Uh, do you believe in God? Uh, well, let me see. Let me type it out. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yes. God is good. Christo. Amen. I got this Christ the Redeemer tattoo here. My uh, first day in Rio. If you haven't seen that video, click up above to check it out. We're here, we're going up to see Christ, and they're asking for your vaccine card. And I have mine, but I don't believe Bruno has his. Oh, come on, I know there's a vaccine card in there somewhere. I had no idea they were going to ask for uh, a vaccination card either. I just keep my vaccination card on my phone just to have it there. So, oh, let's hope we get up to see Christo today. There's an alternative of having your vaccine card. The guy informed us there's this app here you can download and it has like all the information of everyone who's been vaccinated in Brazil. Crazy app. But you know, he's typing this information in now and let's pray this works out. Let's go, vamanos. It worked, the app worked, we're going in. Wow, we're here. Chrysler Deemer. Man, huge. Look at that. Cristo. Funky. I just kind of feel like a very good feeling while I'm here. Like, it's Christ the Redeemer, got the tattoo, Christian, and I don't know, I just have like a sense of purpose or just like a sense of, I can't really even describe it, <sighs> but it feels good. Yeah, it's good. Two, you like? It's been a long journey. Man, today I definitely got out of my comfort zone. It was super uncomfortable, you know, trying to communicate with people that didn't speak the language and then have such a big ask. But I did ask that. There are times when I thought, man, like, should I even do this anymore? But I was like, no, I have to do this. I'm sticking through. And we did it. Met Bruno. And uh, I'm glad I went with him. I didn't record it, but while we were up there, he got super emotional, you know, he started crying a little bit and uh, thanked me for bringing him. I could kind of get the vibe that he may have been going through something. We didn't speak the same language. You know, I spoke a little bit of Spanish, which is similar to Portuguese, so we could understand certain words. So we didn't really get a, a good bond, but I could just feel his uh, energy and just how glad he was to be there and emotional and, 
what a day. Um, this is why I like traveling, to have experiences like this. So make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I would love to have you follow my journey, and I appreciate your support. Until next time, fight on.